everybody and welcome to the Vegematic Show. You must have found me by mistake somehow, but I'm glad you're here. And won't you pull up a chair, sit down, relax, inhale some really nice uh, herbal remedies and enjoy the show because you have somehow managed to find the underside of the algorithms the absolute slimy bottom of those algorithms the ones that they really don't want you to see so welcome to another edition of the Vegematic show well what have we got to talk about this week Carl Bernstein now it's not like he was like a really you know a reliable journalist or anything Carl Bernstein who has kind of a good reputation among journalists and experience with the kind of thing that he's been dealing with has mentioned that perhaps Herr Drumpf will not respect a blue wave that perhaps he will decide to throw it to the stacked courts to decide the election what fucking election and I say, really, we're not supposed to use that word. You know what I am? I'm a nationalist, okay? Well, I'll tell you what. It's, it's an imaginary election. It's just like the imaginary riots and people trying to escape the sanctuary cities. Oh my God, run, run, it's a sanctuary city. <laughs> and there's six or 7,000 poor dark people coming to america what will we do my god our nukes will be useless against them so lying ted <laughs> and cruz <laughs> the lion ted has now become beautiful ted he's been rehabilitated <laughs> Man, that's a face that is has been voted over and over most punchable. <laughs> and I, I, have you seen the the photos of the the faked Photoshop photos of the the, the Trump rallies where they have these millions of people and everything, and they're all, I think somebody went around with like a a little paintbrush and dabbed red on each of these like the, found the biggest crowd photo. It doesn't even look like the city it's supposed to be in. So uh, I have it on good authority that <laughs> they're lying. <laughs> they're lying. <laughs> Come on. Come on, people. Uh, well, how, this is insane. It's ridiculous. It's gone too far. And all we can do is uh, laugh and hope for change, but change ain't gonna come with this bunch of gangsters in the most powerful positions in the world and they're gonna stay there because now they put other gangsters on the courts. Isn't that fun? Yes, boys and girls, democracy is a wonderful thing, especially if you get a job with a like a, a really big weapons manufacturer and you can make really ugly, ugly, weapons that maim and rip people apart and tear their guts out and and splatter them all over the place there is money in that my son study work hard to be able to to do something with your life okay like work for uh, in one of these companies massive industrial warfare companies that's where the money is, come on, you, you want a nice house in the suburbs, don't you? You want to be able to pay your bills? Just work on killing people because killing people is the thing that America does best. <laughs>